But you know, this is a bit interesting about it. Here's a fact for you. You know when Pope Benedict came into power, if you like, the night he was uh, elected? Do you know that the, um, whatever the, what's the religious building called? Like, it's gone from again. The what? Yeah. It was struck by lightning that very night. As if God was saying, we don't want this man in power. But I wonder, what does God think of you? When God sees everything and your life, what does God think of you? Because let's be honest, we've all got skeletons in our closets. We've all told lies. We've all looked at things we shouldn't have. We've all had angry thoughts. What does God think of you? The one who sees everything about you. I wonder what he thinks about you and your sin. Because I'll tell you, there was a, a, a deal that was done, if you like, 2,000 years ago. Jesus on the cross, all of your sins, the worst things you've ever done, was laid on Christ. And there's a transaction that can take place. The worst of you is put on Jesus, and the best of Christ can be given to you, can be put into your account. So you can be broke, you can be the, the poorest man on earth, and you can be a spiritual millionaire if you put your trust in the Lord Jesus Christ. It's true, is it? You know it. I can tell this woman's got a smile on her face. You can tell a Christian because they've got joy about them. Most people, these atheists, I'm sorry, you're not doing any credit for atheism when you're walking around like a, a sack of potatoes. The truth is this, there's a joy that we know our sins have been forgiven. We know there is one who died on the cross and rose from the dead. And I'm asking you to consider these things today. Do you know the true Jesus? Not a, a fake Jesus, but the true Jesus who beat the grave. The true Jesus who loved you and died on the cross. Think about these things. God bless you all. If you want to have a chat to us, you don't have to come up to us now. Just come and talk to us. We'll be glad to have just five minutes of your time. Thank you, Joe. Okay, you can leave that on. Uh, it's finished. All right, Paul.